In today's video, I will show you how to install and use Pulse Secure. Pulse Secure is an SSL VPN or Secure Sockets Layer virtual private network tool that allows your machine to remotely connect to any internal network with a secure connection. SSL VPN means that a browser is used and does not require installation of special software. The remote access includes web apps, client server apps, and intranet access. This means that your machine will temporarily appear as if you are physically within the network that you are connecting to. This tool is available for nearly all popular operating systems, including Windows, Mac, Linux, even iOS and Android mobile devices. This is what the software looks like once installed. You can see how simple the software is due to its minimalistic features that make it easy to use. There is also an icon on the toolbar that looks like this. It is going to be a black and white S. To install Pulse Secure, open your preferred browser and go to Google. Next, you will want to search for Pulse Secure. The first link that comes up should say Pulse Secure, Secure Access for the Next Generation. Once you click on that link, you will be taken to the Pulse Secure website. Upon arriving at this website, you are going to click on the Try Now button. From here, we are going to click on the Download Here from Looking to Download the Pulse Client. At this point, you're going to fill out your first name, your last name, and your email, and then click Continue. Then on this screen, you're going to fill out your information. I have fact-checked this, and it actually doesn't appear that you have to put real information in there. But anyways, you can just press Continue. You will then be taken to this page where it claims that you have mail. So I'm going to jump over to my email. And I have the email right here. This is what it's going to look like. Um, go ahead and pick your operating system here. Uh, most of us have a, either Windows 32 or 64 bit, so just be sure you check that before you install it. But once that installs, we're just going to go to the actual client. Um, once again, this is what it looks like here. This is Pulse Secure. To properly connect to the University of Michigan, I will show you how to set up your Pulse Secure. The first thing we're going to do is go to Google again and search for U of M Flint Pulse Secure. And this is the first article that you're going to click on. Once you're at this website, we're going to scroll down to the Launching Pulse Secure. After that, we're going to open up Pulse Secure again. And then we're going to go to the Add Connection. Once we're inside of there, we're going to leave the policy secure, the first option, and then we can name this Pulse Secure. And then the server URL is going to be set to vpn.umflint.edu. And all you're going to do after that is click connect. Now you are prompted to enter in your LAN credentials, which means your unique name and then your password. You can save these settings and then connect again. And you are now connected to the network. You will also be able to see this little arrow that says connected. And when you're done, you can either right click on that and disconnect, or you can disconnect from within here. I also wanted to mention the applications that you could use with Pulse Secure, such as Microsoft Outlook, um, the remote desktop connection, mapping network drives. ImageNow, WebFocus, and any desktop application that requires a connection. Um, thank you guys, and my name is Christina Benchettle, and I think that's all for this tutorial today.